Hi everybody, welcome back to the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure OCI course. In this lecture, we, we are going to look at how to create a new identity domain. In the previous lectures, we understood the identity domain. Now it is the time to create a new identity domain in the OCI console. So let's get started and see how we can create a new identity domain. In order to create a new identity domain, you must have the certain privileges so that you can create an identity domain. Now, once you log in successfully in our OCI dashboard, click on this hamburger menu. Under this, click on this identity and security and go to the domains. As I explained earlier, Oracle creates a default identity domain for you, which is on the root compartment, which is your Sanjay 111G. And here you see a new the default compartment has been created for you wherein all these users are gets created and all this group if i click on a default compartment you can see users groups dynamic group application all the users which i have created previously all the groups which i have created earlier and some default group the dynamic group application oracle cloud service so if i simply log out and log in again we'll show you one thing to you so when you try to log in and with the default domain, you will see identity domain is a default. It didn't give you any option to switch the domain name because we have a single domain. So let me go ahead and then create a new domain and then we'll show you we have a, another drop down wherein you can switch to the domain in which you wanted to log in. So go to this identity and security and click on a domains. And here you can create a domain into different compartment in the next lecture. I will show you how to create compartment, but since I have another compartment called training, I am going there and then creating a new domain. So click on a create domain and let's say a uh, dev domain, for example, and you can give a uh, description development domain. And there are various types of domain like one is free which has some limitation, like you can create only 2000 users in this free. You have a, a type of domain, which is specific for Oracle apps, the premium external user. Now, along with this domain, when you create a new domain, you can also assign a new administrator if you wanted to assign, or you can skip it and you can create a domain administrator later. So I will skip it. And here you see, you have to select the compartment in which you want to create a domain and click on a create domain. Okay, so I have not selected, let me select the free one and then click on a create domain. So once our domain is created, it will be visible here. Let it be created. It will take a certain time. Let it be created. Now here you see my dev domain has been created successfully with zero user and two default groups. Now, if I click on this dev domain, you can see I don't have any user in this domain. I do have two groups. One is domain administrator and all domain user dynamic group application. So this is the complete domain wherein you can create a different set of users like for your development and they will try to use this dev domain to log in if the user is created into this particular domain. Now, if I log out here and then log in again, you will see a drop down wherein you will see the the domain in which you wanted to log in, let's say dev domain and then next. And then here you have to enter the username password. If you wanted to go back, then you have to go to this cloud.oracle.com. And then next, since I have not created any user, so I'll simply go ahead and then log in into my default domain and then next and enter my username password here, as simple as that. So guys, this is how you create uh, identity domain in uh, in OCI. That's all about this. Thank you. Bye bye.